Hi, I'm here with Eric Quinn, none other than the founder and CEO of Siglent. Thank you very much for joining Thank me, you Eric. Thank you, Thank It's you. not every day we get a, a uh, CEO of a company here yeah, in the lab. Yeah, but I think uh, from today, maybe one more CEO will visit you in the future, yeah. Excellent. Yeah. You're all, so you're here from uh, China? on a visit. This is your first time here in Australia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Very beautiful country. And yeah. so you want to move here? Mm, maybe. 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 All right. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so tell us about Siglet. When was it founded and why? Mm -hmm. uh, YOLO. Uh, in 2002. 2002. Uh, I'm a software engineer and uh, uh, one of my classmates, Jackie, Jackie Sao. Jackie Sao is a hardware engineer. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, we have a goal. Uh, make uh, every engineer in world world have professional um, test and equipment. Yep. So we begin to develop the oscilloscope. And uh, is this a bench one or a PC based? Um, bench one. one. Bench one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> you know, uh, in that time, um, we we don't know. It is very difficult to, to design our. Uh, bench oscilloscope. So mm -hmm. in our original uh, scale, we prepare use half a year to complete the whole prototype. But uh, at last, we use yep. two and a half years. Wow, very very difficult. It took yeah. a lot. So you thought it would take six months, but it yeah. took two yeah. and a half years. Yeah, yeah. To yeah. design your first bench oscilloscope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and uh, launched uh, that model number in two at the end of two thousand five. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Right. What was the uh, specs of that oscilloscope? What bandwidth? What sample rate? Oh, in that time, uh, <coughs> the bandwidth is two hundred uh, megahertz, mm -hmm. and the and the sampling rate up to one gigahertz. Hard. So that was very hard to do. Yeah. Back in two thousand and two, is yeah. it easier yeah. now? It's easier today. Uh, I, I think uh, it is easier now, but in that time, very very hard. You know, right. we do many research <coughs> works. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And where were your who who were your competitors when you decided to start? Was it Rigol or were you looking for um, Agilent at the time? Oh, in that time, I think the competitor maybe Textonics and Rigo. Yeah. Yeah. You know, uh, I I have a uh, very interesting uh, data. Mm -hmm. uh, in two thousand six, our ship quantity only five percent of one of our competitors, 2006, but uh, uh, to 2000, at the end of 2011, mm -hmm. only uh, five years later, our quantity has beyond these competitors, only five, five only years. Only five years it took you to grow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Excellent. very, very crazy growth, very, yeah. very rapidly, yeah. How many employees do you have? At the uh, in, in current time, around uh, 300. Already, yeah. Right. Is and that one third of yep. uh, R and D engineers? One third are yeah, R and D yeah, engineers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent. How many do hardware and how many do software, firmware? Uh, I I think uh, uh, hardware around uh, forty to fifty and the software uh, around the sixty. Yeah. How complex is the firmware mm -hmm. in these? How many lines of code? Do you have any idea? Oh, you know, <laughs> at the beginning, I, I plan to use half a, half a year, but uh, at last I use more than two and a half years. Two I think a, the, yep. you know, what the software is uh, designed by myself at the mm -hmm. beginning, the, the first one, first, uh, first mode number, but now oh, I'm, I'm a businessman and yes, I don't, uh, don't code over already. And I think total, total code uh, more than more than how to, how to how to say it more than 200 thousand 200 thousand lines, lines yeah, of yeah, code yeah, yeah. in a typical a bench oscilloscope yeah 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 yeah, yeah. and did you use uh, what sort of operating system are you using inside these is it linux uh, or is it uh, yeah, windows yeah. ce you know we have some different uh, servers some mm -hmm. uh, use linux and some uh, use windows ce and some maybe other uh, platform, other uh, operating system. Yeah. Why don't you standardize on just one platform? Uh, you, you know, and and the and the beginning, uh, in that time, if you use the uh, Windows C or use the Linux on uh, blank phone, 
In that time, yep. 2005 is, uh, I don't think it is impossible. Yeah. Right. So in that time, we use uh, uh, Atlas own uh, Opera system. It is mm -hmm. a small uh, Opera system. Uh, I don't remember the, the name. But Yolo, uh, after some years growth, we found uh, this system. Uh, yeah, it is enough. So we change, change from uh, from that uh, system to uh, Linux. Yeah. And so all new instruments will be running that? Uh, yeah, most of our oh. our new equipment uh, are, are running on Linux, Linux. but still yeah. have, have some special use other mm -hmm. other systems such as the Windows CE or, yep. or, 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 or others. Yeah. Got it. So I take it the software is harder mm -hmm. than the hardware. Mm -hmm. Would that be correct? It's harder mm -hmm. to write the software for an oscilloscope than it is to actually no, design I, I, the hardware? I, I, no, I, I, don't, I don't think so. No? YOLO, uh, both hardware and mm -hmm. uh, software uh, is uh, uh, difficult, yep. I, 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 I think. Yeah. If okay. you want to uh, develop a, a good scope mm -hmm. or a good uh, IW generator, you need a good hardware designer and a yes. good software designer too. Of, yeah. of course, yeah. yes. In that case, on the hardware side of an oscilloscope, which is more difficult, the analog front end, mm -hmm. the analog amplifiers, or is it the memory architecture and those mm -hmm. sorts of things? Which is more difficult? Which is more important to get right in the oscilloscope? Uh, I think uh, the first one is uh, analog uh, front, yeah, front end. end. Yes. Yeah. Uh, the second one may be the sampling system, mm -hmm. the, the ADC, APG, this kind of sense, yeah, and uh, yeah, include uh, the whole framework. <clears throat> yeah, right. Uh, all of them are very important. What is the major cost factor inside an oscilloscope? Is it the FPGAs you have to use, or is it the analog components for the front end? Is it the analog to digital converters? Mm -hmm. Which is like the mo which adds the most cost? To an oscilloscope. Is uh, there any me, one thing let me, that's... Let me see. Um, I think uh, maybe FPGA yep. and uh, <clears throat> analog and uh, yeah and uh, other others together still have display, yes, mental display, box yep. uh, and plastic box. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think uh, yeah most uh, cost come from the chips. Yeah. Right, from mm -hmm. the actual silicon chips themselves. Mm -hmm. yep. You've just released this new 2000 series. Yeah, yeah, it, is, it will be a very yep. fantastic one, I, I believe, yeah. And how long did it take to develop this? Although uh, I know it's based on a lot of previous yeah, yeah, work, yeah, yeah, obviously, yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. From, from the time you decided to do this model, how long did it take to... You know, this one uses the uh, second generation of our SPO. Mm -hmm. Technology, yep. And uh, from the first uh, generation of SPO, maybe four years ago, four, 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 years? four, yep. four five years ago, yeah. And uh, from two years ago, we mm -hmm. be we began to uh, design the uh, version two architecture of uh, SPO. Mm -hmm. And uh, so for this uh, series, uh, around two years. Okay. Yeah. Is it, um, you design low cost test equipment, mm -hmm. mostly. Mm -hmm. um, is that a deliberate choice? Uh, does Siglent want to stay at the low cost, low mm -hmm. end, or do you want to get into really high end, expensive equipment? You know, we uh, design not only low cost. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, uh, we have some not low cost uh, equipment equipment uh, law we are selling inside China and uh, I, I think our, our purpose the first uh, target of segment my classmate and uh, and mine uh, to provide mm -hmm. every engineer the professional uh, test and measurement yep. so you know if you need to provide uh, every engineer the the equipment you have the low cost have the yes. cost best cost performance 
So it is very, very important for a segment. So we focus on this. Got it. Mm -hmm. Now, um, you've got a whole range of, you, you're into oscilloscopes, mm -hmm. signal generators, power supplies, mm -hmm. um, spectrum analyzers? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. And um, is that, do you plan to expand into a larger range of things? I know you do a benchtop multimeter. Mm -hmm. Any plans for handheld mm -hmm. test equipment at all? You know, I, I believe a segment will mm -hmm. always focus on test and environment equipment. It is our 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 goal. Well, focus on, on this, and you know, uh, there still have some uh, other products need us develop. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, we have two two func uh, two direction. One is uh, develop the more hand and more wide uh, scope mm -hmm. family, right. and uh, the other is uh, make our test equipment, uh, the whole family wider, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, is it harder to make money with, mm -hmm. harder to make a profit mm -hmm. with low cost test mm -hmm. equipment? Mm -hmm. Or is it a good industry to be in, in terms of uh, actual profit? It is uh, difficult to to reply. You All know, right. <laughs> sure. the, the, the low end one, uh, the margin, uh, margin, yes, very margins. Low. Yes, very, margins very, very are low. very low. Yes. Very low. But yes. the quantity is uh, very big. A very quantity is high. Yeah. Yep. And uh, and for the uh, for some hand one, mm -hmm. the margin uh, is high enough, but uh, the quantity is is small. So I I think we need both of them. You yeah. need both mm -hmm. industry, yeah. right? But okay. but you know, uh, for segment uh, products, uh, one of our strategies uh, we are supplying the most, the best cost performance mm -hmm. equipment. So uh, our margin is reasonable. So it is uh, means our price is acceptable by uh, most of the customers. Sure. Yeah. Did you start Siglent with the thought that you would sell your own brand products or mm -hmm. did you think that you would uh, be able to sell the technology to a larger company and have them sell it under their name? Uh, YOLO, uh, at the beginning, from 2002, mm -hmm. uh, at the beginning we developed the scope to uh, 2000, uh, maybe 2008, we mm -hmm. haven't uh, our own brand. Right. Our, our, our business come from, come from um, OEM business. Mm -hmm. So all of your business back then came from yeah yeah yep. before two thousand eight right and uh, and uh, from from two thousand eight mm -hmm. we 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 became to we be, began to sell second brand mm -hmm. and uh, and uh, in that time we found second brand sales grows very very uh, fast. Crazy fast, fast. Really? crazy fast, crazy yeah. fast, yeah. Double, triple, three times, wow. four times, and uh, yeah. You know, wow. this year wow. in, in United States, double, double, wow. double than last year. Yeah, you're what? Very, Why is very that? High. I, I thought it would be very hard mm -hmm. to do that to mm -hmm. start your brand from mm -hmm. nothing and mm -hmm. then build. Why was it so successful? I, I think uh, there have uh, some reasons, you know. We focus on uh, myself is a uh, R&D engineer, mm -hmm. and uh, a lot of founder, uh, uh, both of them are R&D engineers too. Yes. Three founders uh, or two founders, a lot of one join us uh, from 2007. Total, mm -hmm. uh, all of three of us uh, are designers. So we focus on R&D mm -hmm. uh, very much. And uh, every year we invest more than 15% of our sales. 15% of R&D, 15% uh, of sales, sales into uh, R&D. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's very high. Yeah, yeah. Especially yeah. Uh, from, I think maybe from four years ago to last mm -hmm. year, I, 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 I had uh, seen the data around, uh, maybe around 20%. Wow. Yeah, yeah. You know, most of our Incomes mm -hmm. focus on the R&D, so we can um, provide the products, the yep. new technology, new products very, very quickly. Especially this year, uh, 
We prepare to launch five new yeah. servers. We have launched wow. include include this one SDS two thousand X. We have yes. launched four already, but we will uh, launch another another one. It is a uh, spec analyzer, a very yep. good spec analyzer. Right. Total five new products. Is uh, is a spectrum analyzer more difficult to design from an R and D? Point yeah, we, we had uh, spent more than four years to develop. Uh, four years four for the years. first yeah, yeah. spectrum analyzer. Yeah, we yep. invest a uh, huge money on, wow. on, on that one. Yeah. Wow, mm -hmm. that's impressive. Is it easy to get or is it hard to get good people, good hardware designers who know, mm -hmm. who know how to design mm -hmm. these? Or did you have to go to, did mm -hmm. you have to steal them from other companies? Mm -hmm. You know, one, <laughs> one more difficult. Uh, no, you know, uh, our engineers come from mm -hmm. two way. Uh, and the beginning, uh, we hire some uh, high end uh, engineer mm -hmm. and uh, build our core team. Uh, maybe around uh, fifteen or around twenty. This right. this 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 kind of guys, the core mm -hmm. guys. And uh, every year, uh, we we are hiring some good students. Uh, some mm -hmm. uh, master degree, some bachelor degree from some famous uh, university of, of, of China. Yep. And uh, training <clears throat> them, and uh, gave them time, gave them gave them space to mm -hmm. to grow. Excellent. So uh, to current time, we I think we have enough R and D resources already. Right, yeah. mm -hmm. and it's mostly Chinese engineers, or have you uh, gotten some ones from the U.S. or somewhere else? No, no, no. It's all, 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 all it's our Chinese? engineers come 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 from China. Mm -hmm. We have some uh, sales team in uh, one sales team in uh, United States and uh, one sales team in uh, Germany, uh, Hamburg. Right. But uh, all our R and D uh, in in China. Yeah. Everything's in China. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Got it. Where do you sit in the market? At the moment, in terms of volume for test mm -hmm. equipment, are you number two, number five? What? You know, I, any, I, I any had, uh, idea? Uh, told this uh, Anita just now. You know, mm -hmm. in two thousand six, we only five percent of uh, one or other main computer. Yep. But uh, uh, at the end of two thousand eleven, we have beyond uh, them already. I think. Uh, wow. In current time, if we, if we, yeah, calculate the quantity of what that is go scopes, uh, I I I believe, yeah, maybe around the number two. This, this number two. Who name. is who is number one at the moment? Oh, <laughs> uh, sorry, I I I can't I can't say the 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 the, the name. That's yeah, all yeah, right. That's yeah, all right. Yeah, we won't yeah. say who number one is, but mm -hmm. you're very close. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very close. Very yeah. impressive. Mm -hmm. What is your biggest market? Is it the China? Is it China? U.S. In in terms of sales volumes. You know, we had uh, uh, built our sub company in United States, mm -hmm. uh, in Ohio in uh, <clears throat> last last year. In in that time, uh, I think uh, from July of last year. The United States market have become the biggest one in in right. this market, yep. and the second one, maybe uh, I I believe maybe China or Europe. Okay, yeah. is it important to uh, keep producing new models, or can how how long can one model last in the market? Like you've 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 just released this oscilloscope. How long yeah. do you expect it to? last in the market before you have to replace this? I think around uh, four or five years. Four or five years yeah, time yeah, frame. Yeah, yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So so you've just released this, so maybe would you are you working on the next would you be start working on the next model now or thinking about the next you model? Know, or would you wait a year and then maybe the, the whole uh, R and D uh, process is like this. Mm -hmm. When we launched uh, some new products still mm -hmm. have some more newer products uh, are developed. Yeah, right. yeah. We are we are develop some uh, new products now. 
Yeah. You know, we have around one hundred engineers. So hundred, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Many, yeah. many products are developed together. Yeah. Wow. What is your firmware update mm -hmm. policy in terms of these? Do you want to release? Do you release firmware on your website so that mm -hmm. it's easy to download? Because I know other companies mm -hmm. who I won't name are very mm -hmm. reluctant to mm -hmm. release their firmware. You, you know, I think uh, service is uh, very important, and mm -hmm. uh, and the uh, firmware update uh, is a very important uh, tool. Yeah. So uh, after uh, some time, we will release our new firmware to mm -hmm. revise some bugs, and uh, I remember from current uh, update version, we gave more details of the, of our. Uh, firmware version, such as uh, what kind of bugs uh, mm -hmm. we have revised in this version, and uh, and uh, what kind of features we have added in, in this version. We mm -hmm. end this kind of document when we release the new firmware. You know, uh, we, we focus on, the, on our customer uh, very, very, very deep. Mm -hmm. And if you buy uh, one of the segment, uh, uh, products don't worry about the servers, don't worry about the right. uh, software bugs. Uh, you know, we have uh, launched uh, S SDS uh, 2000X mm -hmm. in, in this, uh, maybe in this, how to, how to say it, Monday? Yeah. Yes, yes, in, in so this Monday. But uh, Monday. in last week, we had mm -hmm. released a larger, a larger update version of our old SDS 2000. Mm -hmm. So all of our uh, customers who uh, who had bought our old SDS 2000 uh, already can get the same update uh, firmware version together. Got it. We focus on, on our customer very, very, very much. Because yeah. when I did the tear down of this, I found a few bugs and you had it fixed within a, yeah. a, a day or something. Uh, uh, yeah, you, you know, we, we can fix uh, that box yeah. maybe half a day, but you know, we have our progress. You've got progress, to uh, yeah, test. To test it yeah. and, uh, and uh, <clears throat> yeah, do some um, other other progress. So the, I think in one or two weeks, we we update the version mm -hmm. and post on the website. Yeah. Right. Now, something like, well, the function generator and the oscilloscope, for example, it's very common mm -hmm. for most companies now Mm -hmm. to build the hardware mm -hmm. capable, say, 200 megahertz, and mm -hmm. then sell a 50 megahertz version, mm -hmm. and it's only software mm -hmm. difference. Mm -hmm. Is that a concern, that mm -hmm. people will actually hack these things and get, mm -hmm. the, and or is it not really a major concern? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I'm not uh, very concerned uh, about uh, this. Right. Uh, you know, if we <clears throat> give some option uh, to the mm -hmm to the customers and uh, and uh, maybe they they can buy our option to update yep. uh, update some such as the uh, in current time we we give option to to ms such as mso awg yes, there right. is decode this kind of mm -hmm. features maybe in the future uh, we give the option to update the band, band, band right. I don't worry about uh, this such as high hack or, or, or other that I don't worry about it yeah right so is it do you do that to save cost is it a very mm -hmm. good cost saving to actually build it into the hardware and then uh, sell software options yeah it is a it is a good way for the customers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you use that uh, option, the customers can buy our, you know, our products first. Maybe the, uh, the lowest end one, and mm -hmm. uh, and uh, in the future they can buy option to up update it. Yeah, well, we'll use this strategy in in some our our future products. Yeah, got it. Mm -hmm. Now, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to ask this question. It's gonna be very tricky. Mm -hmm. It's going to be very tricky, mm -hmm. but everyone will hate me uh -huh. if I don't ask about... Uh, sorry, uh, what does tricky mean? Tricky means uh, very difficult to uh, answer, okay, maybe. Okay. No so problem. we'll try you. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll try you. Um, there was a lot of discussion on my forum about the eBay mm -hmm. thing, which I'm sure you're aware mm -hmm. of. Can mm -hmm. you tell us mm -hmm. the story behind that? You know, uh, 
Yeah, I, I, so I'm so sorry about uh, this kind of thing. Make uh, make uh, many cust uh, many hobbies. Uh, yeah, are need to are need to angry. Uh, I I'll maybe I give her clear clearly explain about uh, this. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, there have some distributors. Uh, we name them maybe how to say it brown distributor. Yes, war, yes. War, 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 <coughs> on, authorized distributors. Yes, authorized uh, yeah, yeah, distributors, yeah. yes. This, uh, this kind of distributors uh, sell, uh, sell um, to other others, other states, other country, very, very far away mm -hmm. uh, from, from their they located yes. and uh, haven't supply, supplied mm -hmm. any, any, any service. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, this is a big problem uh, for us if 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 this kind of distributors uh, too many, mm -hmm. so from uh, from two years ago, from two years ago we we begin to do our progress, uh, arrange some guy in Second to monitor the, the this kind of di distributors uh, right. uh, on 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 eBay uh, this kind of right uh, yes yeah yeah so you had somebody looking for yeah. issues and uh, yep. and. Uh, if we found this kind of distributors, uh, we persuade them. Oh, you you need to um, sell in your in your in your in your, uh, in your area. Uh, in your area, well, yes. you you need to get the uh, what's the uh, how to say it? Uh, what's the lies from us? Ah, uh, yes, uh, yes, yeah. yeah, you're authorized. Yep. Uh huh, and uh, and uh, and. Uh, uh, you know, if you uh, we 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 do this uh, mm -hmm. uh, process for two years, but uh, from from maybe this uh, I don't know maybe this uh, this September or this yes. uh, August, uh, we we have a new new guy, new yep. student just come from the university, uh, a young girl to do mm -hmm. do this. You know, she got the number one number one test uh, for our. <laughs> Uh, test for the other students. Yeah. Every, every year we uh, we hired many students from Excellent. the university. Yeah, yeah. I, I had told you just now, and uh, and uh, she mm. uh, maybe she haven't uh, enough experience and uh, can't distinguish who is the uh, brown distributors and who is the. Uh, user sell their uh, user, se user selling their things on eBay. Use the yep. equipment. So right. so she done did her uh, Johnson. Yeah. Mm. You know we have done this uh, around uh, two years and uh, um, no no any mm -hmm. accident happen. But right. uh, from this girl, yep. yeah, it was uh, right. uh, it was just an issue. So is it? So you're definitely not targeting second-hand equipment on yeah, eBay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely not. You, you know, uh, one of the most important thing for second brand mm. is uh, our service. Yep. You know, uh, such as uh, we, we supply the uh, newer firmware to our old SDS 2000. Mm -hmm. I think our service and uh, make the customer happy is very important for us, such as yep. we, we, we are supplying the 30 days Reply mm -hmm. no, no any reason replies from yep. from United States. But if you if the customers buy buy the uh, products from this kind of brand distributors, mm -hmm. we we can't do it. You right. know maybe we we can do because we have a sub company in the United States and we have a sub company in in Hamburg Germany. But in South Asia, in Australia, in in other place, in mm -hmm. maybe South America. We haven't uh, our own company. We only distributors uh, buy the uh, products from the local distributors. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe the customers will will have uh, service problem the in, service in the future. Issues. So yes. so we yes, we worry right. about uh, yeah. uh, very much. So we so we do this pro progress. But I okay. think uh, maybe from this uh, this sense uh, we we'll, we we'll, we we'll do it uh, very very carefully. Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. But uh, I I I in here you know in this. Uh, Maybe it is the most famous uh, hobbyist uh, electronic uh, forum <laughs> in here. I, I, I suggest the, the customers uh, please uh, buy second uh, products from the 
uh, find your local distributor. Authorized yeah. distributor, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Because then because then you get the service, you get the local service. Yeah. Whereas yeah. if you buy it from overseas on eBay, mm-hmm. it and something goes wrong and you can't yeah. really return it. It's yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's very difficult. Mm-hmm. Excellent. So, do you miss um, be actually designing things? Because you're a you're a hardware designer. You're a software. I, I'm a software uh, designer. A software yeah. designer mm-hmm. uh, you that you can't do that. Yolo, because segments are bigger and bigger. Yeah. Uh, we have uh, more and more better uh, engineers, yes. better software engineers than, than me. So right. even to myself, <laughs> uh, develop the soft, software. Right. There have some young guy uh, much <laughs> much better than than, than, than me. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. Uh, but it's still fun. Though, mm-hmm. how much input do you have in the R and D mm-hmm. side of things? Are you always are you getting into the meetings for actually designing these, or do you have uh, your organization probably is small enough mm-hmm. with 300 people that you can still mm-hmm. have a personal mm-hmm. hand in everything. Is that oh, you know, no, no, no. Because no. the second, in, in, in the old time, maybe maybe 10 years ago, I can right. do everything. They, they do call everything. the yep. sales, uh, you know, in that time, uh, 10 years ago, only my, myself is there. the only one sales, right. but now we, we can't do it. We have... Uh, uh, more than 100 uh, uh, engineers and yep. more than 50 uh, sales already. Right. So uh, myself can't do anything uh, anymore. Mm-hmm. So uh, we have our VP. Uh, he is our city city CTO, our, 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 part, our yes. partner of segment, yep. and uh, then Mister Mister mm-hmm. uh, Zhao, Zhen Zhao, Zhen Zhao help. Us manage the whole R and D team. Right. Mm-hmm. And uh, our other, uh, our other VP, uh, mm-hmm. he, uh, he is my classmate. Right. Both of us did uh, found this company. Yeah. Uh, JK okay. saw. JK saw focus on the supply chain, such as the purpose, produce, uh, this mm-hmm. kind of. Yeah. And uh, we have another guy uh, focus on the. Uh, domestic uh, market. Mm-hmm. Myself, or a little more focus on the uh, oversales uh, market. Yeah. Got it. Mm-hmm. Do you plan on being number one in the test? Everyone. Uh, I, I to hope be so. One. I hope so. But uh, I, I, I believe the uh, mm-hmm. everything step by step. Yeah, everything. Mm-hmm. Uh, yep. Let it go naturally. Yes. yes. They don't push it uh, to. Yeah. Thank you very much for coming all the way to mm-hmm. Sydney, Australia. Yeah. Thank Appreciate you, Dave. Thank you. Excellent. It's not every day we have a CEO. I hope you enjoyed that, guys. Catch you next time. Thank you.